everybody! So, it was my birthday on Monday. Oh my gosh. Yay. Um, but anyway, I got lots of Lush for my birthday. Some of it was for gifts or gift cards to Lush or just money to go to Lush. So, I went to Lush and picked up some stuff and I'm going to also show you some products that I got actually for my birthday that people gave me in like bags and stuff. So this is like a ginormous collective haul. I'm going like this a lot, but anyway, this is so huge. Um, I did a ginormous birthday Lush haul last year, and that went over, like, that's my most viewed video, and that was so exciting for me, because, like, that was my first video that actually got a decent amount of views, and that's when I got more and more subscribers, so... Hopefully this will go just as well, and I hope you enjoy, so, yeah, let's get started. I picked up, well, I didn't pick up, this is actually from a gift. Thank you, people. Whoa, sugar's falling everywhere. And this is one of Lush's sugar scrubs. Lush has two sugar scrubs, and one of them is just called Sugar Scrub, but this one's called Sugar Babe. And this one smells really nice. It smells like vanilla, sort of soapy, and very nice. And it's really nice and exfoliating to your skin. This is what it looks like. It's really pretty and really nice and very softening to your skin. And there's, like, pink in the middle that's, like, very softening to your skin. I sort of forget the name of it. But okay, so it's cocoa butter in the middle. Brain fart. Anyway, but it's cocoa butter, and it's so nice and softening to your skin. And it's really hard to um, explain the smell, but it smells so nice. It smells better than the sugar scrub. But anyway, and how you use these, they're kind of hard to use. But anyway, you just break a little piece off before you get in the shower, or you can crumble it up, but whatever. You break a little piece off and scrub all over your body. It just makes you so exfoliated and really nice. So that is the first... Thing. So the next thing I got is called a shower smoothie, and they have three shower smoothies, but this is one I got. It's the almond and coconut smoothie, and how you use a shower smoothie, you basically just use it as soap, and it's just really creamy and feels really nice on your skin, so I'll just show you. This is how it looks. It's just very thick, kind of looks like whipped cream and feels like whipped cream on your skin, and just feels so delicious. And it smells delicious. Oh my goodness, this is the best smelling shower smoothie ever. I wish they had a soap that smelled like this. Um, smells like vanilla and almond and just very creamy and it smells so nice. It just smells a little bit like almond, I think. And then just coconut, a tiny bit of coconut. Oh, it's just so nice. And this was made by... Reggie. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so I got the shower smoothie off my hands and his name is Reggie. Okay, just leave me alone. I'm just a kid. Okay. Anyway, so let's get to our next product because I have a lot to talk about. Okay, so this one's a bath melt. I don't normally get bath melts a lot, but this is the Floating Island bath melt. You can, it's huge. Like, it's one of their humongous, um bath bombs. It looks like a cupcake with top cut off. Oh, oh gosh, guys. Ah, <sighs> this smells, it smells a little bit like the almond and coconut smoothie. And it also smells like their butterball bath bomb a little. So it just smells like vanilla and creamy and sort of like white chocolate and just it's really nice, and I really like it, so here's what it looks like. I think I said bath bomb earlier, sorry, but it's a bath melt, and it's really moisturizing. Okay, so again, this is just so nice. I'm going to cut this into, like, fourths. It's bath bomb, bath bomb. Bath melts go a long way because they're so moisturizing, and they leave the bath really silky and soft and very smooth. Plus, I don't normally get bath melts often, so I want to save them. This is kind of expensive, but I think it's worth it. Ooh. So, now I got a soap, and I talked about this in, I think it was my last haul. Sorry if I'm wrong, it might be my second last haul. This is the Figs and Leaves soap. 
Now it doesn't look as ugly as my sample because this is more of it and you can just see it better. And you know, oh, this smells so nice. Let me just give you a close up. So it's not quite ugly, but it's a little bit weird looking, I have to admit. There's like real fig seeds in there and uh, yeah, my nails look terrible. If you smell their Dorothy bubble bar, that's what it smells like. It just smells very floral and sweet and very nice and feels great on your skin. It's exfoliating and creamy at the same time, so it's a really good soap. It's a kind of expensive soap. This chunk was six dollars and two cents. I mean, I think it's worth it or I wouldn't have bought it, but it just smells so good. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to talk about is a mom for Mother's Day. I kind of missed out on the moms this year. Yeah, but um, they have these in flowers, you know. They have them, they have this one in Space Girl, Vanilla Fountain, and Avo Bath this year. And I got the Space Girl one, so I just love them so much more when they're having little flowers and they're just shaped and they're on a little stick. Kind of looks like a little lollipop. Plus, the tag has seeds in them that you can plant. So my sister tried to plant some of these last year. Yeah, it didn't really work out. But anyway, <laughs> the Space Girl, so this is Space Girl. I know it doesn't look like Space Girl, but it is Space Girl. This smells... <coughs> Sorry, I'm kind of getting over cold. This smells fruity and kind of sweet and girly. And can you guys hear my clock? It's like anyway. So oh, eh. so this was given to me, and it was perfect. This is the dragon's egg bath bomb. It was perfect, and I was so happy that I got it because I wanted to use it in a cocktail. And then I was wrapping it up in this, and the bag that I put it in fell over onto the floor, and it got smashed really bad. So I'm just going to focus it with the plastic in it, so sorry. And it has lots of cool stuff in it, and it's, it will still work and stuff, so yeah, that's the crack side. And I hope you guys don't mind if I put it in a cocktail. This has confetti and sparkles and all kinds of stuff. It's so exciting. And I was just so pooped that it cracked. It just smells so good. So that's the dragon's egg. I'm sad that it cracked. <laughs> okay. So, let's see. Ooh. So, the next thing I got is a bubble bar. Oh, my leg is falling asleep. Anyway. And here it is. It's the Dorothy Bubble Bar. They almost discontinued this bubble bar. And I was about to cry. <laughs> no, just kidding. I was about to cry. <laughs> but anyway. This. I was so sad that they discontinued it. But it, they they made a big mistake. So they brought it back. Okay. So I think that they originally brought this for Easter, but everybody loved it, so they just decided, okay, well, we'll just keep it, okay, okay, and then they're like, okay, we're going to discontinue this, and then everyone was like, oh, and they had a huge retaliation, retaliation, and they're like, uh-oh, that was a big mistake, and then they brought it back, so yay, okay, so this has the exact same scent as the figs and leaves, so they just smell really floral and sweet and nice, so they go together very well. So it's really cute, Bubble Bar. It's like summer bubble rainbow. Yeah. So that's that Bubble Bar. Just saying, that's not my actual voice. I don't do that. Anyway. So that's that. <laughs> So the next thing I got is a bath bomb, and I would never normally get this, except I was just trying to get newer things, like the floating island. I wouldn't normally get that, so I got this, and this is the Geo Fizz bath bomb. This bath bomb used to be a bigger bath bomb, but then they downsized it. Um, and this bath bomb has, like, sea salt, and it's really nice, and I've never used it before, but it just smells really nice. It smells... It smells like green, you know? It smells sort of foresty and 
earthy kind of smelling, and I thought it was pretty nice. It's very minerally with all the salt and all the planty thingies in it. It has lush, lush. I don't know if you can see that, but anyway, yeah. So that's the diff. <laughs> <laughs> it smells kind of like trees. Eh. <laughs> it's nice. I got dust all over my hands. Okay, so I was at Lush spending my birthday gift card, and um, I told them that it was my birthday and everything, and they were so nice. They gave me a little birthday gift, I guess you could say, and it even had a little bow, so I'm going to show you what's in it. I don't know if I can open So, the first thing that was in this little Lush gift was this lip lip balm lip balm and it's called lip service and it's just a white lip balm but let me show you and it smells really nice so as you can see it's just white and it smells like their therapy massage bar the therapy massage bar smells like to me like chocolate oranges I don't know what those things are called but the little orange chocolate things that you break up with the with your hand you just got and they like come up in the slices. That's what it smells like, and it's really nice. I'm just gonna. <laughs> Next thing that I got was the Helping Hands. It's just like a big sample, like they're huge sample pots. And this is like a pink lotion, I think. It's like a hand lotion. I think it was made for doctors. Okay, so this has like an herb. Herber. This has like a herbal smell. They didn't quite fill this up, but who cares? It's free. Alright, so the last thing that I got in my little present, and the best thing, the Shimmy Shimmy Glitter Bar that, um, yeah, I've talked about this in my massage bar video, but I have never owned it, so yeah. Okay, so this glitter is less blue and chunky, this is more like fine. And I like this one better, so to each his own, you know? Okay, guys, I have glitter all over my hands. Anyway, it's like totally like glitter-tastic. Anyway, this smells like vanilla. I think a tiny bit like of flowers. I don't know where I'm getting that, but it's kind of like perfumey. Perfumey, perfumey. Anyway, but it's really nice, and I'm really excited that I got that. So that's the Shimmy Shimmy Glitter Bar, and I don't know how to get this off. I also got three little things. Two of them are samples, and I think the other one's sort of a sample. I'm not sure. But anyway, first two ordinary samples I got was the Rockstar Soap and the Vanilla Delight Lotion. I'm not going to go into that, you know. I think all of you guys know what Rockstar looks like. Right, so the last thing I got, which is kind of like a sample, is the center of a dragon's egg. So it's basically just glitter. The lady was like, do you guys like glitter? And we are like, yeah, we like glitter. <laughs> and then she's like, okay, well, here's the center of a dragon's egg. And she's like, whenever you want to add glitter to your bath, just throw in this and you'll be glitter-tastic. So I was really excited about that that because not many people get it. So I'll just show you what it looks like. So do you guys see how glittery that is? If you can't, sorry, the lighting's terrible. But anyway, it, you guys don't even know how glittery it is. It, when you put it in your bath, it will be so glittery. I think I'm actually going to break this in half. All right, so that was my Gigantor, Gigantor, Gigantor um, birthday Lush haul. Uh, this was so fun. I loved it. But anyway, um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.